What's up, everyone? Welcome back for the next round of bowling. Fuck yeah! Alright, so we'll see how craptacularly I do this time, because I'm fucking terrible at this game, and it's awesome. Then again, I'm terrible at most of the games that I play. It's kind of why I do what I do, though, you know? That's why I literally put in the description of all my videos, again, this is a YouTube channel where my mission is to show you how to properly suck at video games. And that is a fact, because I suck at video games better than anyone else. And that is a fact. Of course, I say that as I get a strike, but still. I suck pretty well. I don't mean to brag, but I'm pretty good at sucking. That's probably the gayest thing I've ever said. Alright, anyway. <laughs> I know, I'm an asshole. I can't help myself. But anyway, uh, this is actually going to be kind of a um, more upbeat video, because uh, I've got some actually pretty good news, I suppose. Um, I, I don't know if you necessarily say it's good news, but it's something that I, I'm pretty proud of, i got to say. Um, so this has kind of become a tradition since last year. I should say it's not a tradition yet, but I'm going to make it a tradition this year. So last year, during this recording session, because every year... Um, now, for the past, like, three or four years, I've done Brunswick Pro Bowling on uh, New Year's Eve, uh, like I'm doing right now. And last year, I made a bold prediction that by the end of 2020, my YouTube channel would have 250 subscribers. And at the beginning of the year last year, I want to say I had, like, 150 subscribers, I want to say. So I predicted that I would gain about, like, 100 subscribers on my YouTube channel. And that was a bold prediction. That's why I called it a bold prediction. Because I never thought that I would actually get even close to that, to be honest. And I gotta say, you guys pleasantly surprised me this year. Like, holy fuck. I got way closer to that than I ever anticipated. So my bold prediction, again, from last year, um, at the end of last year that I made, was that by the end of 2020, I would have 250 subscribers. And I am currently sitting at 226 subscribers officially. Unofficially, I think the number's a little bit higher, but the number kind of fluctuates from time to time because YouTube is kind of stupid sometimes. But officially, I have 226 subscribers, which is insane. Like, holy shit. You know, I made that bold prediction mostly as like a smart-ass kind of thing. Like, I never thought I'd even break 200 subscribers by the end of the year, to be honest. But I'm like, you know what? I'm going to make a bold prediction. I'm going all in. That's why I'm calling it a bold prediction, you know? And holy crap, I got a lot closer than I thought. I, I, I didn't even think I was going to break 200 subscribers, if I'm being honest. But again, I made the bold prediction just because I wanted to do something bold. You know, I wanted to make a bold prediction. And that was my bold prediction for the year is that... I'm going to break 250 subscribers. And I didn't quite get there, but I got to say, I got a lot closer than I thought. Like, I made that bold prediction, again, partially, you know, expecting that I wouldn't even get close. But holy crap! Uh. 226 subscribers I'm sitting at currently, and that's just, whew, fucking crazy. I mean, by my channel standards, anyway. Again, most people out there would be like, multi-step, why are you going ape shit over 200... 26 subscribers that's nothing and yeah I, I admit you know in the grand scheme of things compared to like most other youtube channels that's pretty much nothing i fully admit that and i i know that but still you know when you work hard at something like i have on this youtube channel any bit of success that i have i am happy with you know again that's not why I do what I do. I don't do what I do because I want to have, you know, 10 million subscribers and be some famous YouTuber or any of that bullshit. Fuck no, man. I do what I do because it's fun. I do this purely as a hobby, not because, again, I want to gain 10 million subscribers and be a famous YouTuber. You know, I don't have some grand illusion about, you know, becoming a famous YouTuber or any of that bullshit. Again, you know, I'm not a fucking idiot. I don't think that I'm going to become a famous YouTuber. Or any of that shit. You know, because I'm not. I, there's no way that I'm ever going to become a famous YouTuber. There's just no fucking way. I mean, granted, I'm not necessarily opposed to the idea, but there's a lot of advantages to running a small YouTube channel, you know? Um, for example, you don't have the media going after you every time you say something stupid, you know? That's a plus. I don't have to worry about media backlash or basically any backlash at all. 
you know, so that's a very big plus to running a small YouTube operation like mine. The other, the other upside to running a small YouTube operation like mine is fan interaction. Because we have such a small fan base here on Multistep, I'm able to interact with each and every one of you on a one-on-one -on -one basis, and I think that's really cool, you know, it creates a much more, uh, much more of a deeper connection between me and my fan base, you know? Granted, I only have, like, maybe a couple people who watch my videos consistently. Granted, which is fine, you know, that's fine. But, um... Shit, lost my train of thought. But yeah, it's it's still awesome, you know? It's still awesome. So, uh... Yeah, God, 226 subscribers, that's awesome, you know? I don't care what anyone else says, some people might say, Wow, it's pathetic that you're going ape shit over... You know, 226 subscribers, that's fine, you know, you're entitled to your opinion, but I personally think that's awesome, you know, I, I love each and every one of you guys out there who's watching my videos, you guys are awesome, and I just want to say thank you for the, you know, thank you for even taking the time to watch my videos, I appreciate it, it's awesome, you guys are the greatest fan base in the history of YouTube, don't ever forget it, you guys are fucking amazing, so again, I just want to say again, you know, thank you for even taking the time to pay attention to some small little YouTube channel like mine. You know, that's uh, that's very awesome, and I very much so appreciate it. So, yeah, again, some people may say it's a mediocre accomplishment, but I think it's pretty freaking awesome that I have 226 subscribers. That's pretty freaking amazing. It's much more than I thought I was going to have, I'll say that much. So, yeah, 226 subscribers. So, yeah, I didn't quite make it to my bold prediction. I was about... How far off? I was only 24 subscribers away from actually making my bold prediction a reality. I was a lot closer than I had anticipated. So, that's that's freaking awesome. Um... And hey, I would not have been able to get this close without you guys. It literally would not have been possible without you guys. So, again, thank you. That's fucking awesome. That is just straight up fucking awesome. Man, two, 226 subscribers. That's insane. That is fucking insane. So, guys, there's one more thing that I want to do during this video. And since I have reflected on my bold prediction from last year, I'm going to make a new bold prediction for this year. And this year, I'm going to go really bold. I'm going to go super bold this year. I have a feeling that this next year on YouTube is going to be even better than 2020. Because 2020, for all the bullshittery and the fuckery that happened during 2020, my YouTube channel had an amazing year in 2020 easily my best year on youtube in 2020 no doubt fan engagement has been up comments have been up likes on my videos have been up watch time has been up the overall views have been up it's been insane my youtube channel relative to how it usually does has exploded in 2020 which again isn't saying much but still you know relative to how i've done in the past my youtube channel has done unbelievably amazing this year um my likes to dislikes ratio has been amazing. Um, and even if people dislike my videos, that still counts as engagement on my videos. So it actually helps me when people dislike my videos, believe it or not, because it still gives the videos more engagement. And that actually helps in the algorithm, believe it or not, which is kind of backwards, but it's funny, you know? Dislikes actually do legitimately help my videos. So, I mean, if you want to dislike my videos, go for it, man. It actually helps me out. You're not hurting me. You're helping me. So, again, it's kind of funny when people dislike my videos. Because, like, you know, you're just doing me a fucking favor by giving me more engagement. So, uh, thank you. <laughs> you idiots. <laughs> but, yes, my bold prediction for this year. And hold on to your seats because I'm going big this year. I have a feeling that 2021 is going to be an unbelievably fucking amazing year on my YouTube channel. I am going to predict that I'm almost going to double my subscriber count. Yes, you heard me correctly. I'm almost going to double my subscriber count. I predict my bold prediction for 2021. Here it is. I am predicting that by the end of 2021, my YouTube channel will have, yes, 400 Yes, you heard me correctly. 4 
100 subscribers. That is my bold prediction for the next year. 400 subscribers. And yes, I know that's probably legitimately an unrealistic goal, but again, I don't call it a bold prediction for nothing. You know, you go bold or go home. And I'm going all in this year. I'm going all in this year. 400 subscribers. Let's make it happen, guys. Four fucking hundred subscribers. Let's see if I can make it happen. Again, I highly doubt it. I highly fucking doubt it. I'll be the first one to admit. I highly doubt it. But we'll see. We will fucking see, my friends. We will fucking see if I can make it happen. So, yes. Again, thank you guys for all the support. It's awesome. I never even thought I'd get close to my bold prediction from last year. And to be honest, I really don't think I'm going to get even close to 400 subscribers by the end of next year. I highly doubt I'm going to get even anywhere close to 400 subscribers by the end of next year. I highly, highly, highly doubt it. But... We'll see. We'll see. You never know. So, um, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll see how close I get. But that's my bold prediction for next year is that I will have 400 subscribers by the end of next year. We'll see if it happens. We'll see if I even get remotely close. If I even break 300, we'll see. But you never know. I'm, again, I'm going, I'm going bold for next year. I'm going bold. So we'll see how it goes. All right. Well, either way, guys. Stay tuned for the next part of this game next time. I'll be talking about more updates, uh, more analysis of 2020, and uh, shit to come. So stay tuned. Until next time, peace out.